right, in this episode of Music Geology, we're going back now to 1965 when two NASA astronauts were ready to make history, but not in the way you might expect. It was on December 16th and Gemini 6A was orbiting the Earth with Wally Shira and Tom Stafford on board. They had just completed a rendezvous mission with another spacecraft, Gemini 7, and were getting ready to return to Earth the next day. And it was at this time they decided to play a little prank on mission control. Wally Shira and Tom Stafford decided to report a, quote, satellite in polar orbit around the North Pole implying that Santa Claus himself was out there in space. And then all of a sudden, they whipped out a Honer harmonica and sleigh bells, which they secretly smuggled on board, and they began to play Jingle Bells. Originally written by James Pierpont in 1850 for Thanksgiving, it was later copyrighted as One Horse Open Sleigh in 1857, and then eventually the public adopted it in the 1860s as a Christmas song. Here's a fun fact, the actual very first recording of Jingle Bells occurred in 1889 on an Edison cylinder, but it has since been lost. The oldest version that still survives today was made in 1898. Now let's take a listen to the very first song recorded from space. Here is the entire communication with NASA and Jingle Bells as performed by astronauts Wally Shura on harmonica and Tom Stafford on the sleigh bells. Now that's what we call a Sonic Gemini.